Salutations and good morrow, everyone. Welcome back to our Grounded Woe Mode playthrough, where today we are hopping in and trying not to die due to thirst issues. Um, we are also going to adventure off a little bit further today and make our way over towards the hedge base. That's where we're going to be going today. In fact, we're going to try to make our way over there. And we are going to try to do some of the web sex. Now, I'm not going to be going after, per se, the... Um, lab itself today I'm going to be doing a lot of like the hedge branches trying to get some of those advanced materials on my way over there I'm also going to see if I can grab myself a really quick uh, um, rotten larva blade too so I can grab that as well um, and other than that we're just going to kind of make our way uh, across and see if we uh, don't die here let's listen to this here really quick while I look for a dude drop oh god can I have that yes thank you thought about this in circles yeah, let's just go in here and get some water to a decision it's time to restart spacer development ominent may not believe in it but i know its potential though i must figure out how to return shrunk objects to their original size the first step will be to address the particle transcription errors it seems almost certain that the irregularities are responsible for the failure during the demonstration burgle please bring up all the lab data about the unknown particles Happy to be of service. Notes will be prepared and delivered to your table in four hours or less. <laughs> four hours? What are the chances for less? Delivery estimate will be prepared in two hours or less. An auspicious beginning. Well, we'll get there, Dr. Wendell. Don't worry, you get it figured out. But first things first, let's... uh. Let's grab this dew drop that I was looking for. All right, perfect. We got a dew drop. We got a torch. So if it starts getting a little too dark, we'll be okay. But let's run over here. Avoid these larvae by staying up over here. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. All right, there's my dead body I'm looking for right there. Try not to wake them up. We're going to go very quietly. You cannot wake up if I am sneaking. I'm going to grab all of that. Don't you, don't you do it. Don't wake them up. Don't wake him up. Oh, God, there's a larva right there. Oh, God, I scared him. Run away. Run away. Ow. Oh, my God, they hurt so much. No, 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 no. Run away. Run away. Not enough health. Run away. Run away. They hurt. They hurt so bad. I should have went to the anthill instead. Why did I do this to myself? Okay. We'll go up here. We'll try to go through the robot lab and at least turn on the scanners. We'll do that. If, if we can't do anything else, we'll at least get the scanners turned on, right? Ah! Dang it! There's an acorn right there. Perfect. Let me just get you really quick. That wasn't a top. That was definitely not a top. I need to be a top, please. I need to have a top. Why is my face so zoomed in? Why did I not fix that? Oh, I'm so sorry. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my lord. Oh my god, I'm half tempted just to restart this whole thing just because of that. I am so sorry. I have failed you. I am sorry. Mr. YouTuber kept the screen way too big too long. For 10 minutes that was like that. Uh, what I'll do is I'll just cut it down to only the important bits, and then I'll cut to this part where I was being an idiot. I'm sorry. <laughs> well, for those of you who missed it, I ran all the way over there, and then uh, died, and then came back over here, and uh, went and got an acorn bit, and noticed that, uh, noticed my camera was too big. So there went ten minutes of recording, probably cut down into two. <laughs> Whoops. It's all right. At least I didn't do anything too impressive, other than die to a Ruz tea. But we're going to get him this time. Even though our pants are broken, I'm going to get him. Do I have the stuff to repair this, by the way? I could get the stuff to repair it. Let me get the stuff to repair that. I do a little, little quick, little quick repair. While we're, oh, I didn't even grab the rotten larva blade like I said I was going to. Oh, it's almost like it was meant to be now. All right, let's run over here, grab the rat and ratten. Yeah, the rat and lava blade. Let's grab the rat and larva blade, not the rotten larva blade. The rat larva blade. No. No. Incorrect. Incorrect. 
You shall not do that. Clover can you got any more in there for me? Nope. It's hoping just to top up the food there real fast, but I got a big old deny. Sorry. So it should be right on the other side of this. There should be a knocked over thing with a bunch of sprigs in front of it. No, Mr. Spiderlings, I'm not interested. I gotta fight enough of you in a minute here. Right over here, though, this is where I want to be. This is where I'm gonna get my first actually somewhat powerful weapon in the game. Now, its durability is complete shite, but we're gonna make it work nonetheless. Grab that. Thank you. Run. Run, Pete, run. Before you get attacked by, by mini bugs. Ah, larva! Okay, nope, nope, nope. Nope, can't touch this. No. Ow, God, run away. Run away. Larva hurt. Pants broken. All I wanted was to turn on a switch. That was the whole purpose of this. Was to turn on one friggin' switch. I just want to turn on the resource scanner. Why does Momo have to be so hard? And now my torch is depleted, too. And all the larvae are awake. All right, well, let's make our way through. Run away! Fight each other, fight each other, fight each other. I'm out. My lord, all of my health. All of my health is gone already. Okay, it's gonna be okay. It's just because my armor is complete crap. We can make it better. There is a way to make it better. I just need to get this burgle chip, and we can make it better. I don't even need to get this burgled chip to make it better. I can make it tier 5 right now. I just have to fight Larva, which is not fun, but I could do it. Or I could just go around and get some upgrade materials with this little hammer that I have right now, and that would also help me get up there. All right, where's that rotten Larva blade? I'm going to need that. That that causes poison, and I'm going to need to poison the robots that should be immune to poison, but they're not. But anyway, I'm going to need it. Don't you, don't you fall, don't you fall. I almost fell off. And that would have been death, because I don't have a Tufty. Why? No idea. Should I have one? Probably. Alright, can I make at least one fiber bandage? Yes, okay. Can make two. Let me get some healing done. <laughs> My lord. Oh, I see you're already after me then, aren't you? Punish, punish, punish. Almost got him. Almost got him. Gotta go quiet. It's just a Ruzz teen. I gotta go quiet in an episode. Got him. Got him, got him, got him. My raw science is mine. You can't have it. It's mine forever. Okay, let's go in here. Yes. Yes. Give me these upgrade materials and this food. Brutal quartzite shards. Thank you. Excellent mustache. never caught on. I, I believe them to be far superior to the Mark Threes. Those never lived up to my expectations. How's that? They can only calculate post-cooking burger weights to the nearest tenth of a pound. And they only had enough memory for one seasoning module, salt or pepper. All solved with you Mark Fours, not to mention your most excellent mustaches. Thank you. I won't ever forget this moment. Okay, so, um, yeah, Dr. Wendell talked to Dr. T T Burgle, but any who's it, let's, uh, let's just do this, shall we?
Gabby. Surveyor connection established. Boom. Well, we got it Use updated. Survey stations to scan for analyzed materials. Thank you, Mr. And Robot on my wrist. Stations to expand the survey network. Thank you. Awesome little robot voice. Thank you. Now, we must go on. We must get to the next one, at least. More upgrade materials, and I have to get to my favorite scabby in the entire game. Very important to do that. Now, I've been having a lot of fun with my WoW mode playthrough so far, but I do want to know what all of you guys are thinking of it. So if you guys could just let me know down in them awesome comments that are down below, that would be awesome because I'd love to know if you guys are also enjoying the playthrough. Oh, I didn't even get... Dang it. I was hoping... I was hoping beyond all hope that I was going to get the... Uh, at least one bug piece from in there, but I did not. All right, hop in here. And grab this, and that's marble pieces. That is all three pieces of armor upgraded. And, as I said, scabby. my favorite scabby. Scheme available. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. It is time for us to have bug juice on. Favorite scabby. Ooh, and more granola bars. Nice. Granola bars. Ooh, and a spider infestation. For so long, I have felt taunted by the spiders of the yard. Climbing, <gasps> crawling, a tuft. with the greatest of ease. Oh, and how they delight in violating my workspace. I can't take a single step without getting stuck in their confounded webbing. I'm wasting daylight running, climbing, surviving, traversing this broken land, the entire yard for that matter, has become untenable. But perhaps my spider friends hold the key to my problems. When you're off to the beach, or a day at the park, doesn't matter the time, because it glows in the dark. You can leave your toys home, except for just one, because you can't leave your fling man. But now we fun! Never leave your fling man. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. All right, Pete. I don't, I've never heard him say that before. That was kind of awesome, actually. That made me smile. <laughs> All of a sudden, he started singing about a commercial. That was pretty cool. And I also got an extra stink bug gas sack. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Get some heals. Get out the, uh, get out the old spear. Just keep doing that, because as long as I can block them, I can get some health back. Get my stamina back, go back in for... Oh, they're, they're a little stucky stuck. They're practicing their jumping. Look how cute they are. Almost got... Okay, that's two down. That's two down. One more to go. All right. Grab that oil. water. Grab that, grab those, and this one is zip it. Today, Trudy asked, uh, or rather insisted, I take a break from my work for a family day. I'll admit the argument that preceded my reluctant agreement was one for the ages. She just doesn't understand how important the work is. But in the end, all was not lost. As fate would have it, our little trip to Storm and Beach's Wave Park has given me fresh inspiration. A particular attraction sported a zipline over an undulating pool filled with sun-baked tubers. Basking in the light of the cruel sun that baked them like red, red raisins. <laughs> but I digress. It was the zipline that captured my imagination. Such an elegant solution to my problems in the hedge. When we got home, it was straight back to work. After another argument, of course. You, Wendell, you got a family first, my guy. But anyway, happy that you got at least some inspiration. But look, we got four different things of food here, which is great. 
We got a bunch of stuff like attack stamina here, some thorns, more thorns. I got three granola bars that can help me do some healing. I don't really have anything that's going to help me repair at the moment, but if I can get into the base itself, if I can get into the base and get into the upper part, past the spiders into the upper part, I should, should be able to get to the room where the stuff for me to upgrade or for me to repair is and that's what i'm after right now there's also another chest in this room that i really really want to get so that's also what i'm after so i'm gonna go ahead and poke this out of my way all right all right let's go i'm just gonna say i'm more confident with the axe than i am with the spear because i've used it so much i know it's blocking times and stuff like that Yep, there we go. This is a battle for the ages. I already bought I already fought one of your bigger batter brethren. And thankfully with the compliance badge I can heal all the way back up. Ouch! Oh no, and I'm poisoned too! Oh no, and I'm poisoned too! Oh no, and I'm poisoned too! I gotta wipe him! I gotta wipe him! I gotta wipe him! And just heal! Oh god! Or we were doing- er, spiderlings! Two spiderlings! Heal! 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 It's gonna be okay. Just, just focus on healing. Focus on healing. Ah. <laughs> this is, this is not what I wanted to be doing today. Oh God, heal, God, Pete, heal, 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 Pete. <laughs> Use whatever you can. We're getting back into a corner, boys and girls. We're getting back into the corner. This could be the end. I did it. Oh, I killed them all. Oh, whoa mode. How you taunt me so. How you taunt me so. But this is the chest that I was after. More upgrade materials. Thank you so much. And also, Project Zip. Slowly, my torments come together into one ingenious solution. Trying countless materials, I finally found something to fix my zipline problem. While the bottom formulas were complex to say the least, I've successfully fused the web ropes with raw science. Once again, it proves to be the key. The new ropes are miraculously soft, but have the tensile strength of forged steel. Good job. I've dubbed my new creation Zippy Fiber. Just think of the practical applications! Oh crap. Dettelfloss! Oh, only something without gums would suggest that. This is not some trifle to pick parsley in between trips to periodontal. I will take your word for it, Dr. Tully. Burgle, you're still my favorite. Ow! Oh no! Oh no, the taste tea got me! Oh, where am I gonna respawn? Oh, all the way at my base. It's okay. It's okay. You know what? I'm fine with that. I'm fine with that. We may not have been able to get those upgrades done. Or that, all of that. I may not have been able to beat the lab, I should say. But, what I did get was everything I need in order to make some upgrades. And that's what we're going to do right now. We are going to start upgrading some things for sure. Now, I can make some arrows. And I'm going to make some arrows. But my inventory's full, so I drop them all on the ground. Let me hot deposit some stuff out of my inventory and then grab all these arrows that fell on the ground. Now, I still need a couple other items, including some gnat fuzz, in order for me to be able to get everything that I need. But for now, I'm super excited. Let's get, oh, 10 brittle whetstones and 10 marbles. Yes. Okay. All right. Kind of a waste right away in the beginning, but I don't care. Let's get some upgrading done. All right. So first things first, 
chess piece twice. Start with this once, this once, and then I think legs one more time. I think it's legs one more because I don't have enough to do you. So yeah, it's gonna be legs, legs one one more time. No, not legs one more time. I'm gonna put them away. I'm gonna hold on to them. I'm gonna hold on to them. I could do an upgrade, but I'm gonna hold on to them. And then I think I'm gonna go with the rotten larva. Let me look at let me look at the damage. Let me look at the damage. Crafting wise, let's look here. So pebblet spear, actually, inventory. You damage one. You exactly the same. Your durability is so much more shite than this, though. But you cause poison. But I think I'm gonna go with this because keep me safe. Mm, safe fur. This. What is this? Damage resist. Oh yeah, because I'm taking more damage because of the compliance badge. That's right. But this. If I upgrade this, the speed is just the same as that. But this has a little bit. Hmm. I think I'm going to go ahead and go with this. Unless I want to do the axe. Ooh. The axe is just a little bit better. I'm going to go with the axe. That's what I'm going to upgrade. I'm going to upgrade the axe. It doesn't seem like it makes sense to a lot of you guys. But it does to me. Because you know what? That little bit of extra damage on that axe. For me. It might be tiny. But it's enough to make me dang dangerous in the backyard so i'm gonna take it i'm gonna go with the axe now we've done some awesome things but i'm gonna leave this episode here i'm gonna come back in the next one and we are going to be taking out the rest of that hedge base and then we are gonna make our way into the pond we're gonna grab some rotten flippers and then we are gonna make our way over into the lower pond where we can grab mussel sprouts and once we make our way into the lower pond Everything is going to be better. You guys just wait. I'm going to grab the gas resist um, Ominent badge. We're going to get over there. We're going to grab muscle sprouts We're going to have everything we need to start making a bunch of smoothies It's going to be a great episode. So make sure you guys are sticking around Make sure you guys subscribe and also guys don't forget to leave me a comment down below of some helpful tips and tricks That you guys might want me to try out. Hey, why not? But anyway, thank you guys all so much and as always I'll see all of you guys in the next one